Alright, so around two and a half years ago, I remember searching on the internet trying to figure out how to start my own cloud learning journey. At the time, I barely knew anything about the cloud, and it seemed like for every website I went on, people were recommending a different cloud course. It was really confusing for me, and what ended up happening was I jumped from resource to resource trying to figure out which one to use. I did eventually find some amazing courses to learn AWS, but all that googling probably wasn't the best use of my time. Fast forward to today, I've gotten 5 AWS certifications, I've spent 2 years at AWS working as a solutions architect, and now I run this YouTube channel where I help people build their technical skills and land a job in the cloud. And so in this video, I'm going to share with you the best free AWS cloud courses I recommend for beginners. These resources have been really useful for me and by sharing them with you, I want to help you save some time and money when it comes to choosing what course you should use. If you find this type of content helpful, please give this video a like. And with that being said, let's jump straight into resource number one. So the first free AWS cloud course I'd recommend is this six hour cloud practitioner essentials course. This course is part of AWS Skill Builder, which is a platform designed by AWS for cloud learners. It's a foundational level course for beginners and helps you prepare for the AWS Cloud Practitioner exam. In this course, you'll learn about AWS Cloud concepts, the core AWS services, and other cloud topics like security and pricing. So whether or not you end up paying the $100 USD to sit the exam, the course itself provides you with a great foundational understanding of AWS Cloud. And another reason I'd recommend this course is because it's created by AWS themselves. If AWS makes any major changes to their cloud offerings, then they'll update the courses to reflect those changes. AWS Skill Builder also has a bunch of other free courses, like this mini course that explains the different job roles available in the cloud. They do also have hands-on labs where they provide you with a sandbox environment, but that's only offered in their paid subscription plan. If you're learning AWS and haven't started using AWS Skill Builder, I'd highly recommend signing up to a free account and trying out their courses. The next resource I'd recommend is Udemy courses. Many people don't know this, but Udemy doesn't just have paid courses. They actually have an entire library of free courses and tutorials. With free courses, they don't provide a certificate or instructor support, but you'll be able to access the online video content for free. You can see here that they have an AWS Zero to Hero course, a cloud computing with AWS course, and even a career focused course to help you start your career with AWS. All three of these are completely free and there are many more AWS courses available that don't cost you anything. I'll leave links down below to some of these free Udemy courses if you'd like to check them out. At this point, you might be like, Lucy, I'm kind of sick of watching video courses is there a more engaging way to learn? If you're in that situation, I'd recommend AWS Cloud Quest. It's pretty much an online game that teaches you about AWS Cloud, but what's really good about Cloud Quest is that it helps you build skills through hands-on exercises and activities where you actually get to work with AWS services. So as a player, you enter a virtual city and choose a role, like Solutions Architect, and you complete missions tailored towards the role. And by the end of it, you receive a digital badge that you can showcase on LinkedIn. I haven't played Cloud Quest myself because it didn't exist back then around two years ago when I first started learning cloud, but my 16 year old sister has and she really enjoyed it and learned a lot from the game. There are also some other ways you can learn AWS without having to watch video courses and one of them is by doing AWS workshops and hands-on labs. As I've mentioned in many of my previous videos, I really believe that the best way to learn cloud computing is by playing around with the services. If you're new to AWS Cloud, make sure you check out these two websites that feature over 100 step-by-step -step guided AWS tutorials. A common question I get asked is, Lucy, I know many of these tutorials are available for free, but does it cost anything for me to use AWS services? The good news is AWS does have a free tier for certain services, so you can experiment and learn without incurring a high cost. But you do have to be aware of what's free and what isn't. So make sure you take a look at this page before you start building things in your AWS console. Before we move on to the next free course, I'd like to take a moment to tell you about today's video sponsor, Guardio. Because so much of our lives are online these days, it's important to know that super common cyber scams can be accessed through our browsers and threaten our security and information. And that's where Guardio comes in. It's an easy to use browser extension that acts as an online bodyguard, protecting users as they browse online. It detects and blocks scams before they reach your browser to make sure you don't fall victim to cyber crimes. So what does Guardio actually do? It identifies and blocks phishing attacks, malicious downloads and websites. It also removes pop-ups and ads that may lead to scams. And it helps protect your online identity and sensitive data. Here's a quick demo of how Guardio works. Download the extension, sign up for an account, and then you'll be able to scan your device for any existing risks or data leaks. 
After your scan, you can start a 7-day free trial, remove threats, and have real-time 24-7 protection. By the way, one account includes 7 members, so you can make sure everyone in your family is safe online. Guardio isn't just another Chrome extension, it's featured by Google and has over a million users. So to see Guardio in action and scan your browser for free, head to guard.io forward slash techwithlucy. Now let's get back to the video. Another free course I'd recommend is this AWS Cloud Practitioner Certification course taught by Andrew Brown on the Free Code Camp YouTube channel. If you don't want to sign up for any accounts and just want to start learning cloud straight away, then I'd suggest watching this 13 hour course directly through YouTube. I've watched the entire course end-to-end -end back when I was first starting to learn cloud and what I liked about it was that there were a lot of demos and diagrams that made it easier for me to understand new cloud concepts. The final resource I'd like to share is free live training provided by AWS. This is something I haven't seen shared around very much but AWS actually provides instructor-led training completely for free. Anyone can attend and they have cloud training days as well as exam readiness sessions to help you pass AWS certification exams. For example, you can see that they have this AWS Cloud Practitioner Essentials Day that's five hours long and provides a detailed overview of cloud concepts, AWS services, security, architecture, pricing, and support. So if you're looking for free training, I'll leave a link down below to the AWS Training and Certifications events page. Okay, so now that I've shared with you the top free resources to learn AWS, I'd highly recommend watching this AWS Certification Roadmap video where I share a step-by-step -step roadmap on how you can start your AWS certification journey. 